Hello everyone, and welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero. And we're picking up right where we left off. Last time I had made Standard O2 tank, fin, survival knife, scanner, sea glide. And when I was watching back the video, I realized that the sound effects were turned down way too low. So I've turned everything up. So hopefully it comes through better on the video. Because it's kind of awkward when it's like, oh, that's so creepy. And you can't hear anything, or if you hear it, you barely hear it. When, for me, it's just blaring in my ears because, you know, that's how loud it is. So hopefully I've made the appropriate adjustments and we can continue on with the game now. So, since I have the sea glide, I think I probably need to start moving towards the Seamoth or, you know, some other form of transportation. So that means I need the mobile vehicle bay, I need, um... Oh, what else? Oh, look at that. I was looking for these, but I need um, just more blueprint fragments that's not that one. Some of the wildlife down here is very grabby. Hey, get back here. Drop it! Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Okay, so I need to stay away from the sea monkeys, apparently. I didn't let any of them get close to me last time, but apparently, yeah, they grab whatever's in your hand. So, yeah, I'm going to look around. I'm going to try to find fragments. That's pretty much the only thing I can do right now. I don't even... I don't even think I have a habitat builder. So I'm supposed to be looking for the research station. can't see anything in this fog. Oh, and another thing. Kind of, you know, while I'm still thinking about what had went on last time. I didn't have the music turned off. It just was not playing. But since I shut down the game and restarted it. All Terra supply cache nearby. But anyways, now it's starting to play. Emergency supply cache. Okay, there's a PDA. I'm gonna immediately grab that. Um, supply crate, med kit. Supply crate. That's a flare. Okay, supply crate. Water bottle. I can scan that. Maybe that will give me the um, habitat builder. Or maybe it's a deployable. Oh, no. No. Back off. Nutrient block. Oh, hang on, there's... Grab trap. Okay, I need a second one of that. Another nutrient block. Okay, yeah, there's these boxes everywhere. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Okay, and I also see a cave system under here. I doubt that it has the resources that I need, but... Okay, I'm going to keep looking around here. It seems like there's a good chance that I'll find fragments. What is that? 
Oh, it's a creature egg. Sure, I'll take a creature egg. Okay, now that everything is louder because I turned up the volume, it's even more creepy. This is not what I... This is what I was trying to avoid. Okay, sea light fragments. Anything down there? I see something right there. I don't know that it's worth it. But... Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Really? Already? Man. Wait, there's a grab trap again. Alright, so... That was... It wasn't quite a bust, but, you know... Not as good as I was expecting. Oh, right, I picked up a PDA. That's what I can do. I can look at that PDA. I'm telling you, Sammy, you see some weird things when you spend half your day in a sea truck. More vandalism? Was it the sea monkeys again? I don't think so. I can't shake the feeling this planet is cursed. <laughs> There's no such thing as a curse. Yeah, you're probably right. That's nothing. You wouldn't want to hear about it anyway. Just a huge creature frozen in ice. What? Where? In a cave, not far from your lab. And here's the extra weird part. As soon as I called it in, they closed off the area. Don't want anyone going in there. But why? Sammy, I'm no biologist, but I think there was something wrong with it. Its skin just seemed off. Alien. An alien on planet 4546B. No. I'm serious, Sam. Something ain't right. Wish I could show you, but I can't get back in there. You can't, but I might know how to. Whatever you're thinking, we never had this conversation. Well, it seems like, um, Sam was just, uh, into trouble constantly. Maybe I could start focusing my search around the supply cache. Because, I mean, there's got to be a reason for the supply cache being in that particular spot. Maybe. Because it was in a big hole. Like, you look up and then there's just ice cliffs all around. If you're able to, Delta Station was our HQ. They were in a big hurry to leave. There still might be information to be found there. It is a big radio tower impossible to miss. So that sounds like it was on the surface because it had a radio tower. Or if it was not on the surface, it was close to the surface. So that's why I'm thinking, you know, maybe look around and see. Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. <sighs> Okay. All Terra beacon signature detected. Unique identifier. Delta Station dock. Well, thank you for... Delta Station. This is the place Lil mentioned in her message. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. That sounds like exactly what I was just looking for. What a coincidence that it happened to show up right as a storm was approaching. And it was telling me probably to seek shelter in it. Well, not doing that. I'm closer to my little emergency pod. Alright, whatever. I'm chancing it. Actually, I will save first. And if anything really goes bad, I'll reload. Because I noticed that there was no auto saves going in and out of that, at least. So hopefully, there's nothing bad about Delta Station. Okay, well I see something broken there. About halfway between the two spots. Okay, it just opened up underneath me. Hopefully I don't live to regret this. <laughs> Half an hour in and I've just now found Delta Station. 
Oh, I guess it's warm here. Okay, did not like that. Traverse territory. Show or hide the signals of your choice with your Xenowark Speedy A. Now with surface support. Okay, I see the tower. Probably need to get a move on it. Fragment. Looks like a hand device. Alter PDA. Some crystalline sulfur. Oh, why am I picking that up? I don't have anywhere to store it. New blueprint synthesized. Oh, okay. Apparently, I only needed one of that. Okay. What is this? Horseshoe shrub. Is this food? Shrub nut. Hmm. If I can grow those, that would be awesome. Should not have picked up the beacon to here. That was my mistake. <laughs> Holy crap. Stop right there, Altera. You're out of bounds. I'm not with Altera. Then your position is doubly precarious. What do you mean? If you're telling the truth, you're out of your mind. If you're lying, there'll be hell to pay. Oh, Wait. fun. Who are you? Stay off my land. Well then, there's crazy people. The woman in the exosuit has been traced as far as my technology will allow. It would appear I'm far less alone on this planet than I had anticipated. Signal location uploaded to PDA. So, I do not know what's up with that. Oh hey, multi-purpose room. Maybe this will get me the habitat. Builder. New blueprint synthesized. Oh my god, yes please. A map will come in handy. I should be able to find my way to Phi Robotics, where Sam worked. Modification station? Oh, wow. Oh, and that's just the full blueprint. Bed? This is just a jackpot for blueprints. Eh. Okay, is there anything else? So, oh, swivel chair. But yeah, there is a quite the nasty storm out there. Okay, is there anything else that I'm missing? Doesn't look like it.
Now, it looks like the storm might be letting up a little bit. There is a second tier to this. How do I get up there? It's right behind here. Okay. I missed that somehow. Oh wait, there's more. Uncle cushy setup. Must belong to one of those higher uppers. Gammy. Looks like it's a private multi-purpose room with an observatory. Well, plant pots are good. That means I'll be able to start growing food. Sam really got under management's skin. I didn't know she had it in her. Take a look around outside, see if there's anything that I missed. There's a solar panel there. Can't exactly scan it. Okay, so currently, I'm at Delta Station. Which is going to be here on this cluster. And Robin said that we should go to the Phi Robotics Center. Which, which one is it? Omega Lab is the bio research. I'm assuming this is Outpost Zero. Cause yeah, this is Kappa. That's more than likely Zero. That's Omega. That's a Delta. That was my stomach. Yeah, that's Phi. This is where my next objective is. I'm currently here. Um, I would need a compass to be able to pinpoint stuff a little bit better. Okay, and here's also my question. Did I get... It's literally not here. Okay, might as well look it up. Subnautica below zero habitat builder. Oh wait, and the Delta Station and on a cargo crate next to the outpost zero and in the copper mining site. It's crafted in the fabricator. So it's supposed to be here. How did I miss it? Okay, let me go check back over here. Maybe it's in or buy one of these cargo crates. Maybe it's on the inside and I just missed it. Maybe it's right here. How did I miss that? Well, unlocking the Habitat Builder unlocked a lot of recipes. Oh. Well then. A material analysis station. Well, oh, so nice to find alien tech so quickly in the game. To think I would have never found it if I didn't go walking around. I really just wanted to know what was going on in this island, but... Yeah, you do what you gotta do. And you find alien tech. I don't know what they'll say about that. Okay, but let me get back. Let's see... Health, food, and water. Not great on the... Frost and enemy heart. Huh. 
an ion cube. It looks like that's used to directly power stuff instead of um, as a material, because it's got a little health bar now. So I need to find a better source of food. Here, what about... Okay, not getting any clippings from that. Well, let's try some of these. No clippings from that. Okay, well, let's get back down to their docks. Okay, we'll look around and see if I can find anything else. Okay, that was one of three for the sea truck. Wow, it gets... What was that? Um... There, there it is, there it is. I'm not crazy. It walks on land. Holy crap. Why is it just right there? Okay, I'm stuck on this island. Never gonna be able to leave it. Too dangerous. Alright, well, you know what? I think that's enough Subnautica for me for today. Thank you guys so very much for watching. And have yourselves a very good day.